Well, hello and welcome to my bathroom where the lighting is terrible and so is the sound. So today y'all are doing me a favor because I need to make a video. I want to make a video. I also need to pack. Well, hello everyone and welcome to a pack along with me video. So today I'm doing two things at once. I'm creating a video for you and I'm packing for me. As you're seeing this, we are just back from a week long road trip. I stress road trip because I don't have to be constrained by airline requirements. I could pack everything in my bathroom if I really felt like loading up a car, but we are, went on a week long road trip as you're seeing this. As I'm doing this, we're about to leave in two days and it does stress me out a little bit to be on the road for that many days. Sunday we leave, we go from San Antonio to Jackson, Mississippi, then we wake up Monday morning and get into Oxford, Mississippi around lunchtime where we'll check into our second hotel and we'll stay in that hotel Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday we check out and check into a second hotel in Oxford because they didn't have a hotel for the full Thanksgiving week. So then still in Oxford, we'll be in a different hotel Wednesday night, Thursday, Friday, Saturday morning, check out, drive to Houston, drop Jake off there, spend, <laughs> that's my oldest son, spend Saturday night in Houston in I think we set the fourth hotel of the week and then Sunday we will be home pretty early in the day. My tip is to actually pack a few days in advance, at least a day or so in advance, and start doing your skincare routine out of your travel bag. That way you'll know if you forget anything. So the travel bag in question is one I have shared many, many times. It's this one from Amazon, the outer pocket. I just wanna make sure it has what I need. I need a headband, like a fluffy spa one, to pull my head back, my hair back, when I'm washing my face and doing my makeup, and then I sleep with a scrunchie. Okay, so we have that. It's usually packed. What I tend to do is when I get home from a trip, I will throw that in the washer and dryer and then put it right back in the bag. Now let's open this bag. Some of the stuff stays in here from trip to trip and then other products I add. So we're just gonna hang this here. You may or may not see all of it. Don't worry, I'll let you know. So in the top compartment, I have my toothbrush that stays there. I have my zit stickers, which I'm gonna need because I have one popping up, yay. I have my variety of eye masks that I always intend to wear. Doesn't always happen, but the intentions are good. I have my floss. Now, I'm noticing this is a little thin, so I'm gonna leave this out on my sink so I know I need to go get like a second one or a bigger of my travel size toothpaste. I'm not, I don't, I just grab whatever I have or whatever the dentist gave me. So right now it's Crest. If I feel like these products are something you'd be interested in, I will leave them listed in the show more portion of this video, but like toothpaste, okay. I do wanna say I like the Quip toothbrush because it comes with its own travel case. It's a really stupid reason to like a toothbrush, but there it is. All right, so we're pretty good there. Okay, this next compartment right here, this is my morning routine. So you can't see my bathroom sink counter area. I'm the vanity. I'm just gonna take a quick photo so you can see what I've been doing. As I've been doing my morning routine already this morning when I got dressed, I left the products that I use out on my bathroom vanity. So I'm gonna go through my routine. And the first thing I see here are 10 days worth of contacts. I wear daily multifocals. I'm gonna pop those actually in here. So we have those. So the first thing I do, especially after I've worked out, which I've been doing lately, is using the Arcona Triad pads. Just kind of gets all the sweat off. It's a nice rinse. I don't want to pack this whole thing. It's a big bulky case. I'm going to leave this out. I'm going to grab a Ziploc sandwich bag and just put, you know, seven pads in there and we can put it in here. So I'm going to leave this out. I do see my deodorant. I swear by this. This one is so good. It's the Mitchum antiperspirant and deodorant, 48 hours. I have gone like 36 hours once, no, maybe longer. And it's a long, long story. I've shared it before, I'm not gonna bore you. It does hold up, but I already have one in here, so we are good. I can put this one back, as you can see, there's a lot missing, a lot of holes. I'm gonna put that back. What is next in my morning routine? The micro mineral soothing toner is always my first step after I wash or rinse my face. And this doesn't look like there's much in there, but there is enough to get me through a whole week. A little of this goes a really long way. And I love this travel container, so in it goes. Next is my vitamin C serum. Right now I'm using the Floretin CF from SkinCeuticals. I'm gonna put that in there. This was sent to me in PR and I am not in any way, shape or form suggesting you go out and buy it. I will link it if you would like to read about it. Don't run out and buy this. It's the La Mer 
the concentrate. And yes, I have noticed that my skin is looking a little bit better, but I'm not sure if it's this or another product that we're gonna talk about. So if you do use this one, let me know what you think. This is the most expensive thing I've ever put on my face, but they sent it to me and who am I to say, no, I don't want this. So I want it and I'm using it. I do really like it. It feels really good. The next step I think might actually be the culprit as to why my skin is looking even better than normal. And it's the newest product launch from Colleen Rothschild. It is her Hyaluronic Serum and it is fantastic. I actually use this morning and night and this has, did I already put it away? This has replaced the SkinCeuticals HA Intensifier. I like this so much better. So staying in the Colleen family, in it goes. What comes next? I always do my eye cream next. The eye cream is sitting here, but I also have two eye creams in here already. Yes, I said two. Do I have two? No, just one. And it is the Colleen Rothschild Complete Eye Cream. Really good size for travel. This is the full size, but in it goes. Okay, I'm putting the other eye cream that I love, the Tarte, um, what is this, Maracuja C Brightener. Putting this back in here, because I already have something. Now I just need my everyday moisturizer. This is the Colleen, not Colleen, Charlotte Tilbury Miracle Cream, but it's small. This is better for a weekend trip. So this one's gonna stay home, and I'm gonna put my regular everyday, normal size, Colleen Rothschild Sheer Renewal Cream in here. And then for sunscreen, lately I've been liking this over my Super Goop. I don't know why, it just feels thinner and it is the SkinCeuticals Sheer Physical UF UV Defense Sunscreen SPF 50. I still have the, I have a travel size of the Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen in here. Other stuff that I have, now we are really packed. I have the um, hair serum. This is from Colleen Rothschild, this is the travel size that I think is currently unavailable, sorry. And I use this in the morning if I have to, you know, after I get dressed, if I need to smooth out the frizz, especially in Mississippi. Boy, they know humidity. And then this is a must have for anyone who's traveling with anyone else. If you're traveling solo, it's not necessary, but the uh, Poopery Toilet Spray works like a charm, it's fantastic. Then I also have this. This is my topical formula for dealing with my hair loss. Fun times. So I'm actually gonna put that in my nighttime routine. So I have a little pile of stuff I know I need to replenish and then add to here. I am gonna zip this up now because it's getting quite heavy. Let's move on to the bottom compartment. There are some things in here already. I'm gonna leave this here because this is getting heavy and I don't want my towel holder to be ripped out of the wall. I don't think it would be, but okay. So now we're just gonna work our way through our routine. So the first thing I always do is use some sort of makeup remover. So I have a travel size of the Bioderma, but I don't think this is gonna get me through the week. You can't refill these, it so annoys me. I do have a full size of my Colleen Rothschild one. So I think this is the one I'm actually gonna put in here. I, I have the room, I might as well use it and I use cotton rounds. This is an old travel container from a grocery store brand. It's fully packed in there. Let's just add a couple more. So this is what I use every night to take my eye makeup off. And then from there, I use the Colleen Rothschild cleansing balm, which I'm pretty sure I refilled. Yep, so that's plenty. This could last me a month, easy. So we're good. What comes next? I would go back and use the La Mer Concentrate and the Hyaluronic Serum. Oh, you know what I, I would use is my Trentinoin or Retin-A formula. The label is worn off, but this guy's gonna go in here as well. And then after the serums, I do my eye cream and I have my Colleen Rothschild, what is this called? Retinol Supreme Eye Serum. I swear by this, this is the best nighttime under eye eye cream. And then I top it off with, what do I have in here? Oh, I stole this from the last hotel. One of those little vanity packs. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. I have the Travel Size La Mer Moisturizing Cream. They sent me the big tub and I just keep refilling it. And clearly, I don't know if you can see that, it hasn't been refilled. So I'm gonna set this down. I do like a heavier moisturizer when I travel. So we're gonna use that. Is there anything that's missing that isn't necessary? No. Oh, here's my bigger version of it. Right there, okay, so I'm gonna pull that down. So we are good with that. And then at the very bottom, this last compartment 
is shell wipes for stains. Magic eraser works really well for getting deodorant stains off of things and just some random stains. And then I do have a little travel size package of gummies. The CB, these were for the CBD gummies that I like, but I just keep refilling them with the CBN gummies. So I'm gonna leave this out too, cause that needs a refill. That's it. Okay, well, if I have to flee in the middle of the night tonight, I'm ready to go with my toiletries at least. If you have any packing tips, especially for road trips, uh, please let me know. For those of you who are traveling over the next few weeks, over the holidays to see friends and family, travel safe, and hopefully some of this has helped you. I really enjoyed this because I got this done really quickly and now I can move on to some more chores, like laundry and washing my makeup brushes. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.